I paid $30 to fish in this pond and I sold the catch to the market. Can I make my money back? Let's find out. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are at this uh, beautiful pond in Fujian, China. And today is game day. What it means is like whatever you fish, you can keep it. You pay for an entrance fee, roughly around $30. The owner has stuck some uh, largemouth bass today and also some catfish. Today my goal is aiming for the bass. Later on, we gotta go to the market and see how much we can sell. Let's go make some cash. <laughs> Let's go. I wake up to a little bit of drool on my pillow, feel like it's gonna be a bad day. Yeah, I'm tired of shit, and the coffee ain't hit yet. Damn, ain't that great? I don't wanna go to work, cause my boss is a jerk, and I'm not even that paid. I need a change in my life, cause I don't feel alive, and there's nothing that makes me happy. Oh. Hold my beer for a minute I'm about to quit my job Cash in for a ticket I'm going on a trip And I don't plan to visit I'm gonna stay there Till I feel like I'm winning all And this is just the beginning I need a big change Help me feel like living I need a big swing Home runs I'm hitting And I'll never look back Moving on till I get it all And we all got dreams We all want things But what you gonna do for it? How you gonna move for it? What you gonna be? And do you believe Guys, we're at the market right now. Let's see how much we can sell. Let's go. All these like a shrimp, mantis shrimp, lobster. No, there are also some like crayfish over there. And uh, there's clam and crab. <laughs> like any kind of seafood you can find it here. Hello guys, I'm back in my apartment now. So today I saw the bass for $20. It was about eight fish in total, which means I took a net loss of ten dollars. There are two lessons that I learned. Lesson one: keep the fish alive. It is extremely important that if you want to sell your fish here, you need to keep it alive. The owner said it is tough for them to resell if the fish are not swimming. In my case, only thirty-six percent of the fish were alive, which was really low survival rate. If I can double that rate or even make it to 100% survival rate, I will make a lot more. So the fish vendor told me there are two key factors determines the fish will stay alive or not. One, dissolve oxygen. Instead of using the regular oxygen stone, I will switch to the nano oxygen stone. Nano stone will create these micro bubbles, which is a lot more efficient than the regular oxygen stone. Number two, water temperature. I've made a video to see which one melts slower, the fresh water ice block or the salt water ice block. Feel free to check the video in my channel. Lesson number two, selling for a better price. After I had sold the fish to the market, I called another restaurant, uh, a local restaurant here. They quote twice as much as the market vendor offered. So for the next game day, I will address the dissolved oxygen and water temperature. And I will sell the fish to the restaurant to see if they want to buy some bass in the future. And that's it for today's video. Like this video, subscribe to my channel, and let me know in the comment below. I'll see you guys next time.